came here for a hamburger, not just any hamburger. We came here to the home of the hamburger, where it was supposedly invented, Louis Lunch. Louis Lunch claims to have invented the hamburger in the early 1900s by creating a quick meal for a man who came in, he wanted a meal on a go. So they stuck the hamburger patty between two pieces of bread, but here you go. But there are other places in the United States that also claim to have a, to be the inventor of the hamburger, and maybe they are. Maybe every, maybe all these places invented the hamburger and they didn't know about each other. Who knows? But here's the famous Louis Lunch in charming New Haven, Connecticut. How many of you guys are uh, yes. local here? Well, sorry, I'm close. You guys have questions I can ask? <laughs> I've been coming here since I was a kid. Yeah, I'm just curious on how many are locals and how many are tourists like us. Oh, okay. I'm from, from Glastonbury. Huh? I'm from Glastonbury. Glastonbury. Yeah. We're from Georgia. And I happen to have a hot dog wagon in, uh, in Glastonbury. And I do steamed cheeseburgers, so I wanted to check them out today here. <laughs> I feel like this is the warm. <sighs> And we live right, on the shoreline. You live on the shoreline? Yep. So you've been here. So we've been here before, absolutely. All right, they finally opened the door at 12 o'clock, and now we're going in. There was a little line out here. Now here at uh, Dewey's Lunch, they make their own ketchup. Let me, let me, can I taste that ketchup? Can I taste it? The ketchup. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I can thought I it was real. <laughs> and there's the oven. Potato salad in a Yeah, salad. So they also have this um, Fox on Park soda. It's it's not from Connecticut. I forgot where it's from, but it's not nationwide, of course. And this is potato salad, but it's more like cold mashed potatoes. But it's still pretty good. Here it is. Wow, with tomato and onions. Thank you. The hamburger is very delicious. It's got a flavor not quite like I had before. And I guess it's due to that cooker. But it's pretty good. This place is really filling up. It's a very small place. And there's a line of people waiting to get in. There's only one table in this place, a big table right here. But then you can salsa sit over here, and then over here. It gets so crowded in there, there's no place to stand hardly. People are packed in there like sardines right now. It's a very popular place. And this whole city is pretty charming. Look at that over there. Looks like some kind of old cathedral or church. <laughs> Pizza place right across the street. What part of Connecticut are you from? Somebody said? Yeah, at the counter. Did you stay with the like that? Yeah. That's funny. I don't have that strong of a southern accent, I don't think.